Hey guys, in this effect house tutorial, I want to show you how you can make an image or graphic follow your head movement so it is attached to your face. So let's go. Hey again, the first thing we will do is to import our picture we want to use for this filter. So for this, we go to the left hand side to our assets panel and here we click on import. Then we search for our picture or graphic we want to import to use in this filter. So just click on it and click on open. The next thing is that we have to go to our scene panel and here also click on add object. Then search for face effects and here select the face sticker. After you have done this, you can already see that there is a placeholder in front of your face that is following the movement of your face. After you have done this, just select the face sticker, the image inside. You can open and close this face sticker object and there is this image. Select it, go to the right hand side and here at texture you can click here on default texture. After you have done this, just select the texture you have imported. After this is done, hit OK. Now we can already see that we have this texture we imported in front of our face. And now I will show you how you can move this picture around or scale it. Here we have a dark face. This will be perfectly um, for a mask filter. So I will just scale this up. So for this, I select my image on the left hand side, go to the right hand side. Here at scale, I activate this. So I just have to um, yeah, change one of the values here. For example, I can set the X to two and now also Y and Z has changed. And yeah, now the image is larger and now I want to move this a little bit up. So it is above my face. But yeah, if you want to use it as a mask, this is fine. So for this, I will just change the position, um, the Y position. Currently it, it is at minus one, but I will change it to three. So yeah, it's a little bit higher, maybe to 10 or even more to 14. The moment it is too big for me, so I will just change it down to 0 0.5. You can also rotate it, so just play around here with the rotate values, for example X. So you can set it to 20 degrees or also the set to 80 degrees. And now you can just yeah, get it to the position you want it to. So I will change the Y position to 12, so it is more down. And yeah, this was all the magic about how to add a picture or graphic that follows your face here in Effect House. I hope this tutorial was helpful for you. If yes, give this video a thumbs up. And if you are new to this channel, it would be nice when you subscribe to it. So thanks for watching and see you in the next one. Bye!